low Taurus Sun Moon Rising and Venus signs welcome and welcome cross watchers I'm gonna take a look at your situation what is going on for you guys with you and the person that you're thinking about this is a message meant for the collective so it's for a bunch of people um, take what resonates leave out the rest and the energies can be interchangeable here according to your situation If you're interested in something a little bit more personal, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you guys. Okay, Taurus. It feels like you were in for a whirlwind romance here. It feels like there's a major decision that you had to make here for your own good. I feel like things kind of were toxic here with that devil energy. This is Capricorn energy. Um, it feels as though we have the mirror. So this is about mirroring each other. This is about reflection projection also mirroring each other self-image relationships reflect our wounds and introspection so it feels as though triggers like this was triggering you were triggered in the past here by this person it feels like you two were both kind of mirroring each other the darker selves the shadow self of ourself here our Shadow self has come out, so maybe this is somebody who didn't bring out the best in you. And the tower, so it feels like things came to light. There was light shed on a situation that brought you a lot of clarity, a lot of truth, and honestly, shit hit the fan. And things got really shaken up here in your recent past, but at least we know this is in the past now. So... This person is trying to pursue you now. The person that you're thinking about is trying to pursue you here. Let's take a look at this situation. And then we'll take a look at you. So, the person that is on Virgo's mind. I mean, Taurus's mind. I almost said Leo as well. Maybe you're dealing with a Leo. King of Pentacles. This is somebody who is very stable. This is somebody who is good with money, go with finances, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus energy here with that King of Pentacles. We got double Capricorn energy here. Um, oh, and we got the Knight of Pentacles. So a lot of earth. It feels like this person right now, they're trying to get their mind off of you through their work and through their finances. They're trying to distract themselves. But Deep down, this person really wants you and they really want to pursue you. Um, this person is trying to come towards you slow. They're trying to make their way slowly towards you. It, it feels like this person is trying to show up as like they want to come towards you correctly and they don't want to like scare you off or anything but deep down this person really does want to pursue something with you and they want to give you an offer but they're trying to make their way towards you slowly here they're taking their time with their approach here they're taking their time with taking action towards you but they're they're coming towards you and they want to chase you they want to come towards you correctly here but it seems that you're you're in a place right now where you are very extremely disappointed feeling stabbed in the back for some of you or you're heartbroken you're in pain there's separation here there's been a separation deception shocking attack so it seems like i mean sometimes the truth hurts right it feels like you have been enlightened to something here. And Two of Wands, you're planning. There's something that you're planning right now. 
three of pentacles and we got the ace of wands you're planning to take action towards collaboration or coming together with somebody who you've been speaking to online or someone who you've bumped into recently or you will be bumping into but i see that you're you've made a decision or you're about to make a decision here after feeling you're at, like you're at a crossroads about moving forward taking action and there's a new spark for you ace of wands it feels like there's potential like there's potential that this could there's something there maybe somebody that you work with even somebody at your workplace you feel like there could be some potential there and um you're making plans to move towards that or to pursue this situation here so i feel like for others of you you could be doing something on the internet, like your work has to do with the internet. The world is in your hands and I see someone collaborating with you. I see a collaboration here and I see you getting some sort of recognition once you start to take action. I feel like you right now at this moment, you haven't totally been set on a decision yet or you haven't taken action yet towards what it is that you're planning to but I see that you feel like there's potential here but you're not sure yet if it's gonna pay off let's take a look at what could happen in the outcome for you Taurus what could happen in the outcome here for Taurus justice Clarified justice. Page of Pentacles. Okay. So I see a mediator. I see that in your outcome, you're making a decision to have a sit down conversation here. So it seems like you're saying yes to something. You're saying, sorry, there was a fly. Uh, Page of Pentacles. You're trying to make an effort. I see that there's an effort here. With this justice card, there's somebody who's like a mediator. This could be a friend. We have a coffee cup, meeting and conversing, savoring the moment, feeling uplifted and friendship. So you guys may end up deciding to just keep things cordial with justice. This is um telling me that this has to do with fairness as well like you're trying to be fair about this or trying to give somebody a fair chance but you want to see if things are going to be worked out here this could be like a counselor relationship counselor therapist an expert somebody who's an expert here justice this could also indicate some that something that has to do with like contracts the court system the justice system uh so it feels like you're there's good news here for you guys good news coming in and there's justice that comes out of it for you so this is karma but this is good karma coming in on your side here because you haven't done anything wrong so i definitely see that there's gonna be a final conclusion a final decision here i feel like you guys might try to put some effort to see if there's something here that can, can be healed by having a conversation with somebody in the middle. Let's take a look at... Yeah, since I'm hearing seeing things from both sides. Like somebody is trying to see things from your side and they're also trying to see things from another person's side without any emotions, no uh, emotions to the situation at all. I'm also hearing misunderstandings. Judgment. I see it, I, honestly, I see like there, there could be another, this could be... A situation that comes back with that judgment it looks like someone's coming back from the dead like things are being resurrected things are being renewed there's another chance somebody's giving another chance here and justice and judgment somebody could work in the justice system 
I'm even hearing like police officer, lawyer, contracts. There's what spirit wants you to know is that things need to change. There needs to be an adjustment moving forward. You can't um, go back to a situation. Things have to change because if not, it's just going to go back to the same way it was. Making but healthier choices. Making healthy choices and love and life, self-love, self-care, being happier. So this indicates strong boundaries. Indicates having some self-discipline as well. Making some changes within yourself. Making choices that are coming from a place of self-love and self-care. By putting up strong boundaries with people and things that you know are not good for you. If you guys are going to work this out, it needs to act things need to change big time. Okay, is there anything else that we should know here? The details, the signs that I'm seeing is like I said earlier, strong Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, and Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius here. Okay. So there could be children involved here. There could be children involved. You could be making plans, maybe even to see a lawyer, to see... Um, I'm hearing your rights. What are your rights? There could be children involved. So, yeah, things could be going down that route because of children. You or this person could be a mature woman, an older woman. We have an ice king, which usually also indicates an older man. Um, this is somebody I see that has money. And... Somebody who is could possibly be very tall or bulky, could be very strong, could have facial hair. Somebody could this man could have also maybe even like gray hair, white hair. Things could have really got shaken up in the previous months, beginning of the year, I'm hearing. So let's get some more cards before I close off this reading here. Is there anything else that we should know? Oh, we got one card already that fell out. Pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. So there's something going on um, that has been a red flag here that needs to be addressed. Chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. I see that there's... A strong magnetic attraction between someone that you're bumping into or somebody who you've been communicating with online. Let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. So the best way to move forward is to let go of for trying to force an outcome. Healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents, your inner child. Situations. From even past lives with that judgment card there. Children, healing family issues. So something could have happened in your childhood, your adolescent life, that needs to be taken a look at. Because it could be a reason why we're reflecting our wounds into relationships around us. So this is what I'm getting for you guys. If it resonated, let me know. If you found some guidance or clarity in your situation, also let me know in the description box below. I do like to read the comments. And if you made it this far, thank you for watching. You're a real one. Bye.